The research that I'm conducting is the effective lag phase on soybean seed development, and this research has never been done before. So we're trying to identify the genetic mechanisms between seed size and seed number, basically yield of soybeans. And we're doing this by identifying some factors that may lead to the final seed size in the lag phase. The lag phase is when the pod of soybean is actually growing, but the seed itself is not growing. The seed is undergoing, this endosperm and embryo are undergoing cellular divisions, but they're not actually expanding. And the past literature has shown that any you know, environmental stresses during this lag phase have a negative effect on seed size and development. So therefore, we hypothesize that there is genetic controls that are determining the yield during the lag phase. And if we can identify these um, genetic controls, we might be able to manipulate them in the future and produce hybrids um, that can yield even higher than we have now, along we might even be able to, you know, use this to combat climate change as that's negatively affecting our yields.